I certainly never would have imagined that Healthy Newsworks would have exploded um, in my curriculum, in my world, like it did. Marion was able to offer us so many amazing people, um, authors and epidemiologists and, you know, community activists that students could interview. So, you know, in a time where students were isolated and alone, I feel like with the help of Healthy Newsworks, I was able to offer them interesting and unique opportunities to, to help, you know, the students learn more, and be better writers, be more healthy, and just learn more about the world. With my sister, you know, I was sharing this with her, what, you know, some of the things that the kids had interviewed about, and, and she had asked me, you know, where I had read that, and I just thought that was so funny, and I said, you know, I've read it in the Healthy News work, you know, our school newspaper that we, we produce here on site, because she thought I had read it in, you know, some official publication or something, and my hope is that it keeps growing and stays here long after I am, you know, retired one day, so I really, I think it's an awesome program, I really do. You know, our students who, involve themselves with healthy news works, they're learning to ask critical questions, they're learning to think about things from different lenses, they're learning to look at different viewpoints and analyze where everybody's coming from and putting together a story. I mean, we've interviewed um, Chef Michael Salmanov, we've interviewed Lisa Klein Ransom, who is an author, we've interviewed doctors, um, I mean, they've interviewed me as well. And that has just been such a rewarding experience. Yeah, I mean, Healthy Newsworks is amazing. Um, and I think the program really teaches kids, obviously, about health. And I don't think that's something that they really learn in school. They don't necessarily have, um, well, in elementary, like a health class that they go to. So it's really great when we can incorporate that with um, the students learning how to do, like, interviews. With the Canvas program, everything was super organized. I knew exactly what to teach. Um, and the content was so relevant. Yet, a lot of times it was information that the kids really didn't know much about, but were interested in learning. The Healthy News Works is just, it is a phenomenal program. From um, the time that I connected with Ms. Ullman and she shared her vision for how it's, you know, supposed to work, not only is it great for kids, but it's also great for staff because what she has um, done is empower teachers to be more inclusive and more intentional about instruction. To me, this is a program, and I've said this to her in the past, it should be in all schools. We also prepare them for writing. Uh, we definitely have a whole bunch of opportunities where they have to first interview, introduce themselves, interview, then they have to sit down and write what they what they interview and how students have to go back into the text, just like it is when we're reading, and figure out, well, how can I word this? What should I put here? How can I change this? So Healthy Newsworks brings so much to, um, to our school. It brings so much to our students that I don't think we've ever in this partnership.